back in the water. Uh, I had a spare GoPro. Unfortunately, my original GoPro with my little diving rig is stuck on the seafloor still. So, if you're near Deception Pass, you find a GoPro with some weird stuff tied to it, please reach out to the channel. I know where it is, but I don't really want to say the exact location because, like, I don't want anyone to poach it from me, you know. Nefarious people might be watching. Um, but if you're a benevolent person and you found a GoPro stuck under the sea, or maybe it was low tide and you just found it, you know, right at the surface or something, then uh, I'd like to have that back. In the meantime, I'm still paddleboarding for my own exercise and benefit. I started on the land way the heck over there. Wait, way over there. Uh, yeah, something like that. Uh, that's Teddy Bear Cove. I think we are in the greater Samish Bay right now. And so, unfortunately we can't find out what's under the water, but if I were to find something on top of the water that was of interest, then I would record it. And it would become another chapter in this video. But if not, uh, yeah, this is, this is where I'm at. This is where I'm at. It's quite beautiful. There's like a bird island over there. I could probably get there, but that's like some more headwind paddling that I'm not super keen on doing right now. I kind of just want to go around the bay, around the edges, and back to the cutely named Teddy Bear Cove. Um, but for now, this is it. I think there's a chance that I could see some kind of little seal or otter or like other kind of thing like that bobbing up and down. I thought I saw some stuff over there, but I think those are just crab pots. I even tried to like, you know, grab on to that little floaty thing over there, but that's, I think that was a crab pot because it wasn't super uh, secured to the seafloor. Anyway, I'm just dipping my little toesies in. Wishing I had my original camera back and my, you know, all my deep sea gear that's attached to it. Um, but now I'm just a, a surface boy. Which isn't the worst thing in the world, but... I'd like to know what's under this water too, you know? That's about it. I guess, uh... Yeah. You know, in November, actually... That's when there's a king tide in Puget Sound, in many areas of it, actually. So, if my camera isn't found sometime this summer, then in sometime in late November, I'm going to go back to Deception Pass, to the area that I know my camera was last seen in, and I'll see if I can just go pick it up, because the water is gonna rush out farther than usual and it'll rush back in farther than usual and that is a king tide so that's the plan if you come across this channel and you're wondering who, whose GoPro you found that'll be me otherwise I'll get it in November and we will see what kind of undersea footage it has captured in my absence probably you know 30 minutes after I left it turned off forever but uh, I think the memory card and everything will be secure so this was a video of me rambling in Samish Bay. Whoa, that thing got really close to that island. Wowee. And, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a huge tanker ship way out there. But this GoPro is not good with distance, so it probably can't even see nothing. Anyway. This is, this is it. I haven't seen a single life form. Let's, just for old time's sake, let's do a quick dunk under the water. I think, yeah, this thing's all good to go. It doesn't have a, you know, a housing to protect it from pressure, but it can go under just fine. So, if there's some kind of fish spying on me right near me, then let's find it. Alright, that was a 
quick dunk just for old time's sake. Just under the surface. Um, if I don't see anything cool, then tune in next time.